everyone welcome back to my channel and another day of crazy hair because um i haven't really done nothing with it <laughs> i know a lot of youtubers get on here and they look so super cute but yeah um i've been super tired i'm, I'm not gonna lie to you guys i don't know what happened but sunday night i didn't sleep at all like i not a wink. I just laid there the full night and then I had to be up at like three o'clock in the morning and I literally just got up, got dressed, went to work. So for the last, let's see, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, I was literally like coming home, eating something, passing out, waking up, eating something again and passing out again. So today is the first day I've actually got to sit and relax a little bit, then get up and clean. So today has just been like super crazy, um, trying to get things cleaned after work and such. So yeah, but anyways, I did get a little bit of magic mail today that I thought I would share with you. And plus I wanted to open up the advent calendar with you guys that I have. Um, we did day one yesterday. Today is day two of December, so this will go up. I know these have been going up fairly late. I'm super sorry about that. I am totally just trying to get caught up with so many things. Um, yeah, <laughs> even I'm trying to get caught up with all the YouTubers that I follow because there are so many YouTubers that I just absolutely adore and they have certain genres that I just go crazy for. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and do the advent calendar with you guys first. Let me grab it because I, I haven't even grabbed it. So let me, oh goodness, I don't mind my white little Lily Jean. Let's just see right there because we're literally like sitting on my, my bed in my room. So, for you guys that know, yesterday I opened up my first day of my advent calendar. Guys, I wanted to say something. I went on there and noticed that the price has definitely gone up on this. I did not pay that price. And I, I don't know if it's because of inflation or if it's because of shipping. Because this did come from the UK. So, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know why... But I bought mine back in August, so I don't know why it's gone up so much in its pricing. I I know that I did payments on it, but I I don't I don't even know how to what to say to that. I know I've seen a lot of pricings go up on a lot of things, and I know that's not a popular subject right now. I'm I'm super sorry about that. I know I have nothing to do with it, but I just went in there and I was like it was like a hundred something dollars. I was super shocked. I was, I'm so sorry guys. <laughs> um, I, I'm just learning that it, if it's worth it, I like the look. I love the little that I can reuse the advent part of it. So I don't know. It's totally up to you guys. You could do, like I said, payment plans and have it paid off in four payments. And it's every two weeks that you uh, pay for it. So Anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and open up day two of my advent calendar and see what lovely surprise that is inside. And I've been keeping the sleeve on it. Maybe I should keep the sleeve off of it so it'll be like less a pain every time that I'm showing it to you guys. But yes, it is so pretty. I am just loving it. We did day one yesterday, so I am going to go ahead and take out day two. And I actually put my little um, pen badge on in my little pin board that I have over there so pretty excited about that I only have one Disney pin and it's like Tinkerbell so I'm hoping to get maybe a few more of those I don't want a lot of pins but I think I want just like a few oh I take that back this mom is brave sent me her extra Jawa pin that she got out of a wish candle and that was my first uh Disney pin. So yes, thank you so much, Jessica. I love watching you and I love seeing you grow. And I feel like me and you are growing together. If you see this video, um, yeah, I really do enjoy watching you. Ooh, I've done that like last time too. Did you notice that? Uh, so it's pretty heavy top. Like it's, it's made fairly nicely. Like it's, Yes, I can't wait to use this year on end to just put little gifts in. 
you know. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into day two. And this is how day two looks of our little advent calendar. And the back has the little Hogwarts crust on it. And I'm going to open it gingerly just because I don't want to ruin it. Ooh, I have never gotten one of these before. Hmm. It is a little bracelet, but it's like a little leather bracelet. <gasps> I am super excited about this, you guys. I don't own a leather one. I have this one. Ooh. And that is what is in my box. And it says Harry Potter on the little clasp. Ooh. And it's so tiny. That's like, I have the tiniest little wrist. So... Oh, I'm putting this on, you guys. There's hands down. So that means that there's going to be, like, little slider charms. Ooh, I am super excited. This did come from the carrot shop, like I like I was telling you guys yesterday. And this one does have the little Warner Brothers logo on it. You guys, I am having a hard time opening it, though, to put it on. I don't know why. I wonder if I can slide it over because I have such small, yeah, I have such small little wrists that... It can just, just be slid over just like that, and that's how it looks. I'm super excited to get little sliders for it, and I have, I don't have any little leather bracelets, so this is really cute, and it says Harry Potter. I'm really excited about that. Awesome little, you know, second day little advent calendar. Sweet! Exciting! I can't wait to see what else I'm going to get out of here. I know it said pin badges, sliders, um, and necklaces, earrings, key rings. It had like a, a quite a few things that it said could be in it. Let me see. Let me read the back for you guys. It says this advent calendar contains 24 products from our silver plated range, including exclusive Christmas theme slider charms, assorted slider charms, earrings. A bracelet, necklace, badges, and key rings. So this must be the bracelet. You get the little leather bracelet. So nice. I really enjoyed that. So yes. All right. I thought I would open up some happy mail with you guys. Uh, some magic mail, some happy mail, whatever you want to call it. I did get my get a package from shop disney shop disney has recently released some new bags for christmas and i was super lucky to be able to get one because they had the floor payment plan yay i know i'm kind of addicted to these floor payment plans of paypal but it has come in handy you guys when you are on a budget and you have an addiction and i have an addiction to lounge fly bags <laughs> Okay, so I have not opened it yet, so I don't even know if they've sent me the right thing. So we'll all find out together. And so here is me box. Here's me box. It's pretty dargon big. And I'm just going to go ahead and open it with you guys. Just like so. With my box cutter. Now, I'm going to show you some paper in it that I absolutely love. And anybody that ever gets... Everybody that ever gets um shop disney mail they absolutely love the little like tissue paper they put in there i save all of mine i think everybody says they save all theirs and which is fine with me so um this is the paper that they put in it i'm sure i've showed it before and when i've gotten anything from shop disney i absolutely love this paper i think it would be fun for scrapbooking Wrapping a gift, making things. I just think so many crafty things that could be done with this paper because it has so many of the different character silhouettes on it. But they're so pretty. Like, they're done so well on it. And then it has Disney and a Castle logo. So. And then we have our little bubbles. And it's a pretty big box for this. But I've seen it and I'm... Yes, I got the little snacks, Christmas snacks one for this year. I have missed out on two Christmas snacks um, bags. One had the little, I I love 
anything gingerbread. So it could be Harry Potter gingerbread. It could be Christmas gingerbread. It could be, um, not Christmas, I mean Mickey Mouse gingerbread is what I'm going to say. And they had a bag that had like all the little snacks and treats on it, it one year. And I really wanted those, those bags like so badly. I'm just making sure there's nothing else in here. I really wanted that bag so badly and I did not get it. So this year I said I am not going to miss out on this bag. This is a $75 bag. Um, like I said, you can do, I think I'm doing like $20 payment every two weeks. So let's open it and see what kind of print I got. Cause it's like one of those older prints. Let's see if I got good placement. I'm so excited and we are going to change out in this bag. So I got my Ginch bag. I wore my Grinch bag to work and I had a girl, she went crazy for it. She's like, if you ever get rid of that, I want to buy it. I don't know if I ever will. I love my Grinch. Okay, here she is. Ah, I'm so excited. Merry Christmas to me. Merry Christmas to me. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas to me. Okay, I think I got pretty good placement. I mean, I don't think you can go wrong with this placement. Uh, with this print, because it seems to have all the same little characteristics all over it. You have the uh, churro, and you have the little peppermint Mickey. You have the little... It looks like the chocolate and marshmallows, and then you have a little small worlds. Looks like cookies. You have the train cookie, and then you have candy cane, and then you also have that yummy, delicious little ice cream Mickey bar that you get, and it has a little Sandy hat, and then you have the castle that looks like a cookie. Uh, the teacup looks like a cookie. Ah! I'm in love with this bag. I love it. It's like a, the color, the red is like a cinnamon kind of deep red. So it's not like a bright red like my other bag. My other bag that has like all the little, um, all the little like animals on it. So let me show you guys. I like my placement. I think I did pretty good. I don't have any complaints at all. I think that the, it's an easy placement bag because you really, there's not really much to worry about on your placement. I love that there's two different churros. So if you look, there's like this like red cute little churro. And then if you look right there, you got a brown little churro. Hmm. It's making me super hungry. Oh my gosh. Look, it has that old fashioned candy on it. Do you see it right there? That's so cute. Oh my gosh. This is a adorable bag. My goodness. And this is what the top of it is looking like. I love that it's done in the silver hardware. I'm a silver girl. I own one gold ring and it's right here. And this is because it was given to me from my aunt. Um, and it was my Nana's. And I think it was uh, my, my Nana's mom's. So it has history and that is why it is on my hands. So let's get... Let me show you the overprint. Yeah, I'm not hitting it. I got really a really good print, I think. I think it looks really super cute. I am in love with this bag already. Oh. And of course it says Disney, Disney Parks Lounge Fly. So, and it has, like I said, it has the silver hardware. And on the hardware, it has that Loungeify logo. 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 And then... It does have side pockets, which we all adore our side pockets. And I am always for a front pocket. I love the front pocket. It's just easy to put a phone. You're like, I'm using this right now that's by Loungefly because it was given to me. Um, so, and so for me, it works perfect in here. And, you know, we love Jack Skellington. So that's my wallet. So, yeah. Okay, so let's open it and see what it looks like inside. I love that they have packed it so well to keep its shape. Any of my bags that I store, I repack the inside of them to keep their shape and keep them nice. Better than nice. So let's 
so. Oh, it's black inside. Like, I've seen it, like, vaguely online, but I didn't see how cute it really is. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh, that's so pretty. Let me get some of this stuffing out, you guys. Because I'm going to reuse this packing and put it in the Grinch bag so that I can basically um, keep its shape as well. Because I'm changing right into this bag. So we do not have an inside pocket, which is fine. I do adore an inside pocket, but having that little organizer by the, Lo the Luna Love Shop has really like... The Love Luna Shop has really made my day. So look at that cute little inners. Oh, I'm bending my bag and I'm freaking out, baby. You guys, hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. You see that? It has a little Christmas tree, the hat, Minnie, Mickey. Oh, it's so cute. Our little Mickey. Oh, they're Mickey ornaments. I, I take that back. They're like little Mickey ornaments, the little Mickeys. I thought I had a mini, like a little bow, but it doesn't. And a stocking, a candy cane, and some little snowflakes, and it's black. Like, I love the aesthetics of this bag. I really do. I love the color. Like, yes. Okay, time to change into it. So, of course, like I've always told you guys, I always keep my little hand sandy with me. It is a number one rule for me having on my bag. I think I am going to put it on that part though so it's just kind of hanging to the side of my bag i always keep a hand sandy let's take this i like to keep these two because they come in handy when you're trying to keep your pocket nice and neat i didn't realize your pocket could get so messed up so easily if you don't have something to keep it all sorts of um like i gotta keep it nice and pooped out and in its shape but it's so hard to get this thing out sometimes. I like putting on a little Christmas movie, so I'm like looking to the side. Sorry. Okay. Voila. And just like that, I am starting to move it back into my bag. So I'm going to put my little wallet in the front pocket. Cute. And inside of the front you can see the bag as well like and then it has the little the inner lining on that part so which is really cute like right when you right when you look in you see one of those yummy ice creams that they have the little the little vanilla chocolate bars that are so good i haven't been to the park since 2015 because i have not been able to um embarrassing to say afford it for a family of five but you know it is what it is guys that's why i just live it on at home how about that oh i could have probably used these in my hair all right so we are going to go into this bag now y'all and i have i think that this one and the next one that i'm going to show you guys um, on another day is one of my last lounge pies that I'll be buying for a very long time. I think that it's, I have enough. <laughs> so, yeah, just, I hope that's what I do. <laughs> or maybe I'll sell some and buy something new, but I doubt I'll sell any of the ones I have because I have so many Star Wars and Harry Potter and Disney ones and they just make me super happy, like... So, this is that organizer, and bam, I am already moved into the new bag, and I am going to be rocking my little treats Christmas bag for the holiday season, you guys. I am super happy to have this bag. I am glad that I was able to get it off of Shop Disney. I think the only complaint I had was, it is a day late. However, it was just Cyber Monday. And I ordered it way before Cyber Monday, but still, you know, it's that time of the year when these guys are out there busting their humps and they're busy and hey, I, it could be worse uh, being a day late or not getting it all. I think that it's not really much of a complaint. I was just, I don't know, just kind of putting it out there. That's the only thing I have to say. 
I've not had any bad run-ins with Shop Disney besides the one little Kermit that I got and he was dirty. However, guest services was the bomb diggity for me. Um, as soon as I like hit them up and showed them and I sent them a picture of him and I really was going to keep him. I just wanted them to tell me like what to, what, what, what to use to wipe him off. Like, so I didn't ruin him because it was a Kermit and, um, he was selling pretty fast and I was like, okay, what can I use just to clean him up? And they're like, we'll just send you a new one. And I'm like, I, I, I'm like, I could truly just, nope, we're, we're going to send you out a new one. They did. They sent me out a new one. So I was just like trying to figure out a way to clean my poor little guy off. And I did end up cleaning him off and I kept him and I gave the extra one to a special little girl that didn't have any Nemo. And Kermit is the bomb. So, you know, you know, you know, you know. Huh. Oh, maybe that's nothing. I think I was like, what is that? I thought something was wrong with my bag and I was about to get upset. <laughs> After I'm sitting here and just waffling along about how I like shop Disney. But yeah. Yeah, it's just from the, it's the white from the, yeah, it's from this. Okay. And then these are your little comfy straps. And then, of course, it has the little crowns. I love it. And I am all moved into it just like that. So, yes, you guys. What do you think about this Loungeify bag? Is it something you want to add to your collection? I didn't have a little treats bag. And I've been wanting a Christmas one. And I think this one is super cute. And I absolutely adore it. I will definitely treasure it for years to come. I like the aesthetics of it. And I like that it's not too cartoony. A lot of the bags are looking a little too cartoony for me. I know that's another unpopular, probably, subject. I'm not liking all the ones that are coming out, guys. I just, I like prints and I like fun, but I don't like too much cartoonish. Like, I think this is as far as I've gotten on, like, as a little cosplay bag. But come on, this is the Grinch. You can't go wrong with the Grinch. You gotta have the Grinch look like the Grinch. So, <laughs> but anyways, guys, thank you for watching and watch me waffle along and like change out of my bag again. And I hope that you guys are enjoying, um, the little Christmas videos. I'm going to try to do one every day. If not, I definitely will be doing an opening of my little advent calendar. So yes, you guys tell me what you think about this bag or what you think about the advent calendar. Are you going to get the treats bag. Look, it's like upside down. No, it's not upside down. Oh, it just looks different when I like see it in the viewer or whatever it is. You guys know I don't do any editing. Everything I do is raw and yeah, it's just how I am. But thank you guys. Thank you to all my new subscribers. A shout out to all of y'all that have been talking to me and hit up that Love Luna shop. You know, she's a small shop. She's She's very sweet, and I am definitely enjoying the organizers. As you can tell, I use mine consistently. There, I got one for a Harry Potter bag. I got one for my Nightmare for Christmas bags, and then I have this one that's all for my Disney bags. So, yes, you guys, you take care, and enjoy your Christmas season, and remember to do what makes you happy, even when other people don't understand it. All right, take care, guys. Bye now.